the medicine goes down, but the music actually goes up on yeah. down. No, I, I saw that movie too. Yeah. Hey, welcome back. We're here with Ellie Kemper, who is just the prettiest, most talentedest person in the whole wide world, and I want to marry her. <laughs> Mary. Uh, no, I. W what I said was, your name is Mary. No, it's not. My name is Ellie. That sounds nothing like Mary. All right, let's get to our next guest. He is a wrestling legend and a former governor. Please welcome Jesse Ventura. Hi. Yep. Good Ooh, to meet you. A strong handshake. Hi, Hi Ellie. How are you? Good. Just sitting right uh, here. Ah, yes, sir. Hello. Uh, what do I call you, Governor Ventura? Look, most people call me governor because they want to avoid being physically assaulted. <laughs> <laughs> Funny. <laughs> Independent governor, yep. You're a fascinating guy. I've always been uh, really... I don't know why I'm fascinating. You mean like a petting zoo? <laughs> I'm fascinating. Come look at Jesse eat a tin can. Is that what you want to see? Oh. I... You, you want to go? I mean, well, I'll do it. You, you will? Fun. Yeah. I just think I'd that'd love... be fun. It's look, if it's got 40% aluminum content, it's going to go down easier. Okay. So, now, you are sort of a conspiracy theorist. Whoa, and... whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, he's just gonna take me on like that. Jesse, you have a TV show called Conspiracy Theory. No, That's why. first of all, I had a, a show called Conspiracy Theory. It was pulled, guess what, by whom? The New World Order. So now I've got a show called Off the Grid. Off the Grid. Yep. I live in Mexico, I'm off the grid. I live in a hut where I hide from drones. Why are you living in a hut? I mean, why can't you get a nice hotel or a condo? I can, but if I do, I have a dummy decoy version of myself that's still down at the hut in Mexico to distract the drones. Okay, but you're now segueing from entertainment into another field? Well, that... I don't know if I'm gonna get there on a segue or if I'm gonna walk the old-fashioned way or maybe rent an Uber or something. Jesse, I have to ask you, are you, you running... You don't have to. You could do whatever you want. Jesse, I have to ask you, are you running for any kind of office? The only way I'd run for office is if I have access to the debates and if there's definitely enforcement of the campaign laws because right now the Koch brothers could just come in and spend the money, and then the Pepsi brothers come in and they spend their money, and then it's Pepsi Coke collection all over again. Sure, I don't think that you exactly know what you're talking about when you say that. You don't think I know what I'm talking about, but I could be damn sure I know what I'm body slamming about. Okay, great, but uh, if you were to run, who would your cabinet be? When you're putting together a cabinet team, you want to look at it like a tag team. Sure. You want something that you can tag in when you're taking a beating in the ring. That's why I say Secretary of Education. I think it's got to be Bobby the Brain Heenan. Who else is that smart that they call him the brain? I guess and not. Some of it's going to rub off on some other people. We're looking at Secretary of State. I'm thinking Hacksaw Jim Duggan. Okay, why? He's got a two by four and he has the American flag. I don't know who better is going to represent what we're doing out there. Know, in those are the right qualifications for the job. Secretary of the office. I nominate Ellie oh, Kemper. Oh, that's adorable. Thank Wait, you. Wait, because she was the secretary on the office? Is that what you're saying? I think that's I think the so. kind of experience that we're going for. If you are going to run, what would you say to the American people out there right now? Well, Scott, I've given it some thought. I don't know if I'm going to run, but if I do, what I would say is, listen, America, I know you're out there because I've been all around this country. I've been from Detroit all the way down to Florida, and I may or may not run for the president, the highest office in this country. And let me tell you something else, McMahon. I'm going to go straight to the military industrial complex, and I'm going to put him in a military industrial suplex. Do you hear me, McMahon? You heard it here first. Wah! Wah! President! Maybe. We'll see. I don't know yet. I don't know. It, it didn't really convince me. What do you mean it didn't convince you? You don't think that's enough for me to run for president, Scott? Well, I just... Uh... You don't think that's enough? What are you doing? Ah, you don't what think... Are, you are you ready to get away oh. with me, Jesse the Body Ventura? Oh. It's coming to an arena near you. The Senate, the National Congress. Watch out, McMahon. We'll be right back with Jesse Ventura and Ellie Kemper after this. Oh. Ah.